All right, if you have a microphone calibrator, then we would like you to make uh, calibrated measurements. It's really easy. It just takes one extra step. So after you have checked your environment and conditions and you see that you can take a measurement that has less than 10 dB of ripple and is not um, you know, closer than the minimum distance allowed, then we want you to calibrate your inputs. And that just means basically setting everything so that it has unity gain. So here in my audio analyzer, I am going to use a sine wave. Make sure that you have your loudspeaker turned off. You don't want to uh, damage anything or hurt your ears. But I've got my signal generator here set to a sine wave, and it is set to a, um, I'm going to set it to a one kilohertz tone, because that's the same thing that my, my microphone calibrator here is going to actually do. So I've got that set 1K tone and it's coming out at minus 12 dB. So then over here on my input meters here, I would expect, I want to see uh, negative 12 coming in there. So I turn on the signal generator and I see it pop up here. This is my loop. This is my reference loop. And now if I adjust the, the preamp gain here, I want to see this hit negative 12. So although this doesn't have numbers on here, I know from the documentation of my audio analyzer that this line here represents negative 12. So I can just play with my preamp gain here until I get as close as possible to hitting negative 12. That looks pretty good. Then I'm just going to do the same thing with my microphone input. So I've got my calibrator here. I have it set to its maximum setting, which is 110 dB. And I'm going to turn that on put my mic in here and now I can do the same thing over here on my input channel I can adjust this preamp gain until I see this get as close to being stable around negative 12 as possible so check this out so now you can just see all you have to do is really just make these match so I've got my reference branch here and my measurement branch here and they both say negative 12 now your inputs are calibrated. You can put your mic back where it was to turn your loudspeaker back on and take the measurement.